Hey YouTube, I'm gonna show you today how to make an antivirus. Alright? Now I got a request to make it. This is what you'll be making. Okay. So you choose your scanning up. Actually, you can watch my other video on that because I don't wanna make I wanna make this one pretty quick. And that's not gonna be quick, but I don't wanna waste your time. So. Now I'll make this in steps just for you, alright? And first, we're going to start off with the main um, form. Now, um, if you pause this video, you take a look at all this, alright? You design it as well. I'll tell you what you need to put in, alright? So, all the source code will be um, in the description on my website. Alright, so if you have any icon files, you can change the icon to a shield. So this is what you're going to need to import. One label that says antivirus. One picture box. Just go to background image, choose your image. Alright. You need a combo box, a checkbox, and the text will be nothing. Change the text it's down here to nothing, as you can see. You need four buttons. Okay. Another label. And if you can see here, I've got another label in here. There's a label in here. See right there? That's that text is gonna be nothing. So you got three labels all up. The title, status, and then that other label. So this is going to have to be uh, label one. The status label will be label two, and the one with no writing is label three. All right. So I'm going to go through the coding. I've already got this in. Oh yes, and a timer. Okay. Now, if you open up my website and get up the source code, I'll show you here. Look, very useful. You just copy it, paste, copy, paste. If you're learning VB and you want to understand it, you can just type it in yourself. That's how I learn. Alright. So, and one more thing. You click on for the combo box. If you want to add some items, you go down to items, collection. You can add them there. And that will be scan for viruses, scan for spyware, and the checkup. Alright, now, sorry about that, um, and that text can be whatever you want, choose your scanning options I prefer, okay, so what we're going to do now, we're going to start coding, alright, so if we double click on this scan button, to bring up the code, this is the code, timer1.start, alright, so that's that code, clean viruses, Oops, I haven't done that yet. So I'll wait for that. Um, stop scan. Timer one dot stop. Label three dot text equals scan stopped. Progress gra progress bar one dot value plus equals zero. All right. Um, now, so once you got that coding. Gonna go to the timer one code, double click that, and just do all this coding. I can't be bothered to read it out, but that's yep. Just copy and paste that in there. All right. Now, once you finish that form, make sure you save it, save your work. There'll be the clean viruses page. You go clean viruses. It'll take you this to this page. So you're gonna make another form by going up to here. Add new item, and you're going to name it whatever you want, and this is going to be the cleaning page, all viruses found. Now, you're going to insert a panel here, and you're going to insert one, two, three, four, five, six, seven labels, put it in this panel here. Major viruses found, make up some crap, whatever, total viruses, make up some crap, doesn't matter. Gonna insert another picture box here. 
another label label here, your virus is at major threat, antivirus suggests you clean the viruses found, blah blah blah. You insert a button and a progress button. Now, and a timer. So for the clean button, so yep, just look at this and put that design, just make it. Double click the clean button. That's gonna be timer one dot start. The timer one um, codes will be here. Alright. Don't forget you can get all these on my website. You just copy and paste them. It's got very useful labels. Alright. So that's that. Um, what you're gonna go do now, you're gonna add another item. This is gonna be the registration form. Register it. It's a fake of your course because it's not real. You can insert one button, one label, one um oh not one button, sorry, three buttons, uh three text boxes, make them small. And for each text box, you are gonna go to maximum length if I can maximum length hmm something like that um, maximum length here four all right make that four so make one button get reg key register and cancel and make a label now for the get reg key is this code here copy and paste it into that button for the register key, 